Alexei Nikolaevich Romanov was the last Tsarevich of Russia, from his birth in 1904 till his death in 1918. Alexei was born at 1.15 in the afternoon on the 12th of August in 1904 at Peterhof Palace in St. Petersburg. His birth was much awaited as he was the longed for heir to the throne. He was the youngest son of the five children born to Tsar Nicholas II and his wife Serena Alexandra. Preceding him were his four older sisters, Olga, born in 1895, Tatiana, born in 1897, Maria, born in 1899, and Anastasia, born in 1901, the Grand Princesses. A mischievous child, Alexei, being the baby and sole heir, was spoiled and often lorded over others with his position. As he grew, however, the child became much more thoughtful and considerate, and his tutor described him as a simple and affectionate child. Alexei was discovered to have had hemophilia at a few weeks old, when his navel wouldn't stop bleeding. It was suspected at birth when the umbilical cord was cut. Hemophilia is an X-linked genetic disorder passed from mother to son. Because of the risk that came with falls, bumps, and cuts, at the age of five, the Tsarevich was assigned two sailors to watch over him, Andrei Derevenko and Clementi Nagorny. Despite this, the prince was an active and happy child in between times in the sickbed. Alexei also spoke several languages, including English, German, and French, though he much preferred to speak Russian. The First World War broke out on the 28th of June, 1914, when Alexei was about to turn 10 years old. He spent the war with his father at Mogilev for long periods of time. He later joined his father at Stavka, relishing his time with the soldiers. He was given the title Lance Corporal in 1916, of which he was very proud. In February of 1917, the revolution began. Tsar Nicholas abdicated on the 15th of March, 1917, in favor of Alexei but later changed it to his brother, the Grand Duke Michael. It is argued Nicholas did not legally abdicate on Alexei's behalf, and therefore Alexei was the last Tsar. The family was placed under house arrest, first in St. Petersburg, and then they were moved to Tobolsk, where Alexei had a sledding accident. He was confined to the wheelchair the remaining weeks of his life. The family was later moved to Yekaterinburg, near the Urals, to the ominous named House of Special Purpose. On the night of the 16th to 17th of July in 1918, the family and four of their retainers were awoken and led to the basement. There, in the early morning hours of July 17th, Alexei, his family, and the four servants were executed by firing squad. He was 13 years old. Alexei's remains and that of one of his sisters were not recovered until 2007, and TNA identified in 2008. They remain in the state archives currently unburied. Alexei and his family were canonized as holy martyrs in 1981 by the ROCA. In 2000, he and his family were also canonized as passion bearers. A church now stands on the site where the imperial family was murdered.